Good morning, Kingsport City Schools. My name is Chandler Woods, and I had the pleasure of completing the KCS experience this May. As I'm beginning to prepare for college this week, I know that you guys are gearing up for another great year of educating our future generations. This year, you'll be teaching our doctors, lawyers, construction workers, mothers, and teachers, too. I always like to say that we belong to the best school system in the world, hands down. But the foundation of a great school system isn't great teachers, at least not in the strictest sense of the word. The foundation of a great school system is great human beings. Because to be a teacher that is great, you have to be a great person. Thanks to the wonderful English teachers in Kingsport, I have learned a lot of loaded, fancy vocabulary words over the years. They're words that may be brief in their pronunciation, but they carry a whole definition of meaning. One such word is teacher. You know, I think we often use words in everyday language that are difficult to define when we isolate them. If I approached you and asked you to define a teacher, you know, what a teacher means, what would you say? I think some of us would offer up the Merriam-Webster definition, which is someone who explains how to do something. Well, this measly definition of teacher surely doesn't suffice for all the wonderful people that were in my life from kindergarten to 12th grade. In fifth grade specifically, I struggled through a phase of unexplainable anxiety. I worried about everything. It was something that I had never done before. And each day that I walked through the doors of my school, I didn't know what was going to set me off, what was going to make me upset. So as I sat in my fifth grade classroom, breaking down emotionally for no justifiable reason, it didn't matter whether I knew what 9 times 9 was or whether my teacher could explain what 9 times 9 was. It took a passionate and an affectionate person to be able to alleviate my panic and still accomplish the goals that she had in mind for the day. Here in Kingsport, we don't have Merriam-Webster definition teachers. We have student-focused, world-class teachers. For teachers, it isn't about the pay, which can only mean one thing to me, and it's that you care about what you do. So I've scrapped the Merriam-Webster definition of teacher, and I've crafted my own. Teacher, a noun. One without a clearly defined role, who must be incredibly versatile, able to morph into the role of educator, mentor, disciplinarian, friend, parent, technology expert, diplomat, and any other role needed depending on the day. A teacher is a person with incredible foresight and selflessness who trades in material success for the vital task of preparing our future generations and continuously inspires people, both old and young. Teachers have to do it all because teachers are the foundation for it all. My mom used to always tell me that people aren't born fabulous, that they are shaped by years of influential role models. The most influential people in a person's life from the time they walk through the doors of their kindergarten classroom to when they cross the stage in 12th grade are their teachers, are their educators in general. I couldn't have asked for 13 years of better educators and I could not have asked for 13 years of better people. That's why Kingsport City Schools are student-focused, world-class. Because the halls are walked by student-focused, world-class employees. I think one of the things that we as human beings worry about in our lives are getting fulfillment out of our lives. I haven't poured the years of dedication that some of you all have poured into teaching, but I can imagine that the longer you do something, the more you worry over and evaluate the fulfillment that you get from it. But let me tell you, I can't think of a more fulfilling activity than serving as the mechanism for the success of others and for the success of future generations. And that's what you do every day when you enter your classroom. As you all begin another school year in Kingsport today, I'm scheduling my classes at the Georgia Institute of Technology. It's a bittersweet experience that I am so excited over, but it's only possible because of the people sitting in Toya Reed Eastman Auditorium right now, some 300 miles away. And I believe that from the bottom of my heart. This year will be full of ups and downs, but I sure hope for every educator in Kingsport that you savor the ups and that you learn from the downs. And no matter how down you may be, no, that every day you are a difference maker in the life of someone, and you're a difference maker in the lives of many someones. Each day you pick up an Expo marker or you grade the 800th paper, you are advancing the lives of the next generation and you are paving the way for the success of our future world. You know, God, when he created the world after each day, he, he called it good. 
he said, you know, he'd create, you know, the animals and say that was good. But I'm convinced that on the eighth day, God created teachers and he called them great. I miss you all and I absolutely wish you the best. Thank you for serving as my inspiration for 13 years and for many, many years more.